are significantly different <laughs> since winning the World Cup. I mean, in a way, sort of everything's the same, just like amplified by a bajillion. I think growing up, I always wanted to be a professional athlete of some kind. Um, when I was very young, it was an NBA player because I love Michael Jordan. But I think probably during the 99 World Cup, that was, you know, the most iconic soccer thing in my childhood. You know, just the excitement and how huge it was for me at that age. My family's always been really supportive of me playing sports. I always say we because I'm a twin, so we grew up, you know, playing all kinds of sports. You know, having to deal with discrimination and being a female athlete, being gay, all of these things have sort of informed my growth in my life along the way, so if I feel like I'm still just learning every day. My teammates, I'm inspired by them every day what we've been able to achieve off the field and the way that we've all grown together. I think when I look back on my career, it'll be you know where we brought the game as a team and, and the place we left it. We use what we are you know exceptionally gifted and talented at, which is playing soccer, to make the world a better place. Well, what do you like about the team so much? Uh, that they like they love equality and they like stand up for what's right. Equal pay. Be more, be bigger than you've ever been before. Yes, we're female athletes, but we're so much more than that. This is my charge to everyone. We have to love more, hate less. We got to listen more. This is everybody's responsibility. Especially after the World Cup, it's so much bigger than our team achieving equal pay. It's about moving forward. The most amazing thing that has come out of this World Cup win is being able to elevate this issue in a way that we've never been able to. Yes, it's important. You know, I wish it happened 10 years ago for me. Um, I would likely see, you know, maybe one or two years of its benefit, um, you know, depending on how long I play. Same with most of the people that are fighting for it now. But, you know, to know that we are taking this torch up and we will run it to its bitter end and there will never be any lack of fight in us. That's a, a really powerful moment where society is making its voice heard.